If you want to start FIFA 16 with an amazing squad, the link is in the description for cheap and safe coins. And for team games and codes, link is also in the description. Hey guys, my name is Suti and welcome to this special dribbling tutorial. I'm going to share with you my best attacking move in this game. Is it a fancy move? No, but it is easy, efficient and this move is going to get you goals and wins. So what is this tutorial about? Is it about this move right here? No, it's actually about this move. As you can see, we just slide past the defenders. I'm going to show you everything about this special move in this video. I told you that I scored a goal with it in my last full Division 1 gameplay video. Here it is. And be honest, did you know? Notice it, this little dribbling thing with Benzema is not automated but actually intended. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet for full Division 1 gameplay videos like the last one with the live controller input so you can see exactly which button I'm pressing at what time and for more tutorials like this one. And if you enjoyed this video make sure to drop a like as well. But let's get into the tutorial now. As usual, I'm gonna start with the best way of using this move, which is simply passing an opponent and scoring a goal after. But before we can do that, we have to start with one clip to check out how exactly we do this move. So what better clip to pick than the one with the live controller input. We need to hold L2 plus R2 on PlayStation or LT plus RT on Xbox and then quickly flick the left analog up and then down as you can see in the top right of the screen. Let's first look at it with some real good slow moves to see exactly what we need to do. We hold the two triggers and then quickly tap the left stick up and then down again. Now let's check out at full speed how quick this actually is. You can see that on full speed the move is very quick and I'm sure no one will even know what you did or even notice it. They will not even see you are doing a special move. They think you are just beating their defenders with luck but now we know better. So now we know how to do this move, let's check out why it's such a good move. You can see the defender is in quite a good position, but now we're gonna do the move. We're gonna go to the right and then to the left again while holding the triggers. And you can see we beat the defender easily. When we move to the right, he's gonna react, he's gonna go to the right as well. And even before he reacted, we are already moving to the left because we can change direction so quickly with this move. And on top of that, we keep great control as well. As we will see later, auto defense is just non-existent against this move. The AI will do absolutely nothing against this move and second man press will also be beaten so easily with this move so we can also use it just to get a shot in as you can see now but also to beat defenders with some dribbling and get a shot in directly after go a little up then go down again we beat him a very very nice goal with uh, Geza Rodriguez and I'm sure the opponent didn't even notice it he noticed this move but he doesn't understand how did it slide past that defender there but I shared the trick with you guys and one more clip this is a pro club so the defending isn't good of the opponent I have to admit that all the other clips are division 1 but this one is nice as well. I did it maybe three times in a row here the trick so the defending isn't good I have to admit it This is not division one. This is pro clubs, but it's a nice goal as well a great way of using this move is just pass an opponent on midfield and after that opponent is out of the way you can go for a deadly assist. So why am I doing this here? I want to pass him so that I can go for a deadly assist after. As we will see the auto defense is useless against this move. I said it before and you can see the opponent is controlling Pogba himself and he's using second man press. The AI is pressing us and as you will see we will just go past the AI without any effort at all. We just run past him. This move is perfect and after we go beat the defense and not just play a driven ground cross into your striker and you're gonna get easy goals all over the place so the AI is useless against this move this time the opponent controls the player himself but then still then still it's very hard to defend and after we beat the opponent we just pass a driven ground pass into a striker and we get an easy goal again so beat the opponent on midfield with this move we go a little bit up and then down we beat him look at that he's over committing up he thought we were going up he was reacting to us going up and before he even started to react we are already going down we change direction so quickly we fool opponents over and over and here on midfield use it again we go a little down look at that he's making the tackle he's reacting to us going down but we're already going up and again we play a deadly deadly assist after we beat the opponent on midfield 
This move is also very efficient on the way, it's actually the same principle, we fake we go to the right, then we go quickly to the left and we can just pass that across the goal for the easy tap in. Look at that, we fake to the right and then quickly to the left, the opponent is confused, he was reacting to us going right and even before we started to react, we are already going to the left. So the best way of using this is again, it's just beating the opponent and then going for the shot, that is uh, actually the best way of using this move. And then maybe on midfield just beating that player and go for the assist, but on the wing, it's also definitely very useful and a great move to use to get that pass in or crosses as well because we will see in the next clip let's first look at this one again a great face of dribbling go to the right go to the left we beat him but here as well we use this move from my last tutorial but we can't beat him great defending by our opponent it's time to take out the big gun we do the trick from this video we are able to get the cross in and we get the goal again and this time we're going to use some face of dribbling here with Games. that's a different move uh, we'll do a video about that too some uh, other methods of using face or dribbling but I think this method is definitely the best one and I don't think anyone else is actually using that so we can also use that to get crosses in the ball roll is the best skill move in FIFA 16 for sure and this move can be combined with very well with it I've scored goals with it in my full division 1 gameplays with live controllers and those goals were no accidents but this is gonna be the end of this video guys I hope you enjoyed if you did make sure to leave a like subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet for more amazing tutorials like this one defending as well and full division 1 gameplays with my live controller my name is Suti see you next time